Good morning, everybody. Again, Charlie Walker uh, here to introduce your MC Master Ceremonies. Everybody, let's welcome our MC Warren Petrick. Good morning, and welcome to this uh, fantastic event. Welcome, everybody. Hope you're uh, hungry, and I hope that you're up for a great, great time today as you are all winners and already in the winner's circle just by being here in attendance today. So we welcome you to the 24th annual Chippewa County Economic Development Corporation breakfast. Very happy to have you here. So if you can sort of find your seats, you're all assigned to a, to a certain table, that will be wonderful. We want to thank some people before we get started, and that would be the Economic Development Corporation investors who are all listed on the back page of your bulletin that you have on your seat. So make sure that you thank them for their sponsorship this morning, their investment in economic development. And I am so honored and so pleased to be here this morning to be with you and out of Madison, which just got back from there. Madison was once described by former uh, Governor Lee Dreyfus as 40 square miles of real estate surrounded by reality. So very happy to be in reality today with you fine folks. You find business leaders, great people that have made investments in people and finances into our communities. So if you would thank those sponsors, and also you have a sponsor at each table. So you'll see throughout the building, if you see any of those folks, make sure you thank them for their table sponsorship, which is a wonderful thing to do. And also a reminder from Charlie and the entire group to read your annual report. There's a lot of great information in here, a lot of wonderful pictures, including our our chair, our board chair, Lisa, who you heard from, and we've already had the annual meeting, so that is out of the way. Also, our special guest today, you're going to be very thrilled to meet this young lady. Amber Balkin is joining us today, and she has a great presentation for us. So we're quite ahead of schedule, which is remarkable, and we'll try to keep everything on schedule and ahead of schedule as we move on today. So when we do breakfast, uh, we will release you by tables and by sections. I believe there are three different buffet lines. And uh, our apologies for the lack of coffee, but uh, there was an accident this morning and uh, the coffee did not make it here. So we hope everyone was okay. I didn't get a report from Charlie as to whether the folks delivering our coffee this morning are okay. And we, we do hope and pray that Everything is fine, but we'll all be fine. We have water and we're set to go and we will have breakfast in just a little while. So with that, I believe we're ready. Is the pastor here, Charlie? Okay. I think if we're, it looks like we're all pretty well settled. It is my privilege to introduce to you Troy Salava. He's the pastor at Chippewa Valley Bible Church and he is going to lead us in prayer to open the meal or open the meeting and give us grace before our meal. Welcome, Troy. Well, good morning. Let us pray for God's blessing and thankfulness for this food. Father, we're grateful to be here this morning, grateful for this wonderful county that you have given to us, Chippewa County. I ask for your blessing on the many men, the women, the businesses, and the leaders who are gathering here this morning to help make this county what it is. We desire this county to grow and to thrive so that we can better use the land and resources that you have given to us and to be a, a county that welcomes those with warmth, love, and refuge, especially for those who are in need. Thank you for the food you've given to us and you've provided for us. Everything that we have comes from your hand. Thank you for your love that is seen most clearly in Jesus. Lord, thank you for all these people who are here. We ask all this in your son's name. Amen. Thank you, Pastor Troy. We really appreciate that. And now, to present our colors and lead us in the Pledge of Allegiance, it is my privilege to introduce Girl Scout Troop number 3055. Ladies, it's all yours.
Girl Scouts, attention. Color Guard, advance. Color guard, post a color. Color guard, honor your flag. Please join us in saying the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the public for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please join us in saying the Girl Scout promise. On my honor, I will try to serve God and my country, to help people at all times, and live by the Girl Scout law. Color guard dismissed. You may be seated. Let's give those young ladies a round of applause. Thank you so much. Thank you for your service to your community and to your nation. That's very impressive. Thank you. Now, the caterer will release the tables for breakfast, so they will be in charge of that. Uh, but uh, if we could note that all of the CEDC -C board members are listed on page six of your annual report. If you would, if you're a member of the board, would you please stand to be recognized at this time? So board members, I'll stand and give them a big round of applause. Thank you for your service to our uh, organization. It's much appreciated. Now, before you eat breakfast, the caterers will be in charge here in just a second. But before that, there's a pretty special day today and a special birthday in our hangar. We'd like everyone to join in wishing Karen Smith a happy birthday from Security Bank. Karen, where are you? Right, now she's probably... Is she, oh, she, they're pointing at her over there. If you want to stand, and we're all going to sing to Karen, so warm up your morning voices and get them going. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Karen. Happy birthday to you. We won't make you run around the room or anything, so just enjoy your birthday. Okay, the caterer is in charge now, so pay attention. Enjoy your breakfast. We'll be back in just a little while. Thank you.